So it's always a special celebration. On this day, we celebrate the birth of the Christ child this season. And in that same spirit, we celebrate the birth of those who've been born into our church family. We do this every Advent and every Mother's Day, and there's always some. This is actually a smaller number than usual, lots of times, but no less special. So I want to introduce John and Morgan Morgan uh, and their daughter, Letty, who wants to hold my hand. Uh, and that's beautiful. And gonna, I think she's going to direct the choir here. Uh, so, uh, but we welcome you and celebrate your, the birth of Letty, how beautiful she is and how full of life. Uh, and we like that. Uh, and then Kevin and Jessica Gray and their son Owen and big sister. Well, Owen took off. I was hoping he was going to keep it. Uh, this is a Mountaineer fan. All of you, Appalachian State. He had an Appalachian State bib on earlier. Uh, and after their big win last night, they were. we all celebrate that. But uh, Kevin and Jessica, we celebrate Owen, what he means for your life, what he means for God's creation. And I always want to say, and it's so true, what a blessing these are. And I hope we can just pause for a moment, realize the handiwork of God and the gift of His creation and how He has a purpose. There's a reason we all are born. There's a reason these two special ones have been given to you as gifts, as parents, given to us as a church and given to this world. We want to dedicate them. We want to trust them to God's eternal design and purpose we just want to pause and celebrate how, what a gift they are as we celebrate this season of gifts. So our children's minister, Mary Langley, is going to lead us from here. Um, in our litany of dedication as a faith community, we are going to covenant to love and nurture and care for these children and their families as well as all of our children. It will be a renewal of that. Our children's ministry partners with parents to help our children grow in God's love, know God's love, and show God's love. On behalf of our children's ministry at Wake Forest, I have for each of you a book set called God Loves Me and Say and Pray Devotions um, for each... Give the empty hands. <laughs> um, as you care for your children, as you have time and read with them through these books about God's love and pray with them, you will be building that foundation that we will partner with you to continue to grow while you are here and participating with us. Would you please join me in our dedication? You find it in your bulletin. The word of the Lord came to Jeremiah saying, Before I formed you in the womb, I knew you. Before you were born, I set you apart. We recognize the remarkable gift of God, the gift of children. As people of God, covenant to nurture and care for these children and families who are entrusted to Thank you, God, for the gift of children. I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, to give you a hope and a future. Thank you, God, for the gift of children. We thank you, God, that your name, that you name as your own creation and call us precious in your sight. May we become like you as we love and care for these gifts, our children. Amen. Before we have a prayer of dedication, I meant to do this earlier. If you are family or special friends that have come because of these families, just stand for a moment. We want to recognize you. I know there's some over right over here. So we, we celebrate you as a larger family. We're glad that you are here today. Delight in this gift that God has given all of us. Thank you. So if you could join me in a prayer of dedication. So God, giver of every good and perfect gift, we thank you for the gift of Letty and the gift of Owen. We thank you for the gift of these parents. And pray that your design and your purpose 
for Owen and Letty will go forth before them, that their reason for being born will be fulfilled by your spirit and blessed by you all their days. We pray for John and Morgan. We pray for Kevin and Jessica that they may know the joy and the energy and all that comes as the gift that these little ones bring them. And so now we dedicate Letty, we dedicate Owen and their parents to your safekeeping, to your glory, to your purpose for them in all their days. In your name we pray. Amen.